Now, I'm not gonna edit the video at all, period, on my YouTube, I don't do none of that shit, you know, I'll show you the full details, one by one, I'll pay, I just wanna pay the first game, get XL, and compare it to the whole screen, uh, session, I didn't do a split screen, so everybody else do, side by side, um, first bet, session load up quicker than XL, and this is a pre-game right now, but the loading time is a little bit quicker. Um, the thing about session is people complain about the controls a whole lot, and it's hard, and it's too hard. But my personal opinion, you know, I like a challenge, so I play however you know I feel. I'm changing the lighting very quick to uh six PM very quick. Piece of time. So um then by both games, first session, they start you off at the opposite stance that you set the game to. So you gotta switch those stuff like the goofy if you're goofy and regular. You can switch stuff like that. And buggy, and that's one thing everybody should understand. And that's the full release. So, that's the problem with that. But session, I can say I like it better, something I like better than XL. Is say in session if you want to do, um, Say if you want any price and you want to go to like a Manny, that's what happens. Say if you want to, uh, let's go ahead real quick and jump off the thing, like off ledge, and do a Manny. It's more easier to do on this game than it is in XL because sometimes XL is very unresponsive. Sometimes I don't know how. I mean, I know how I'm a little bit unresponsive at the end. Grinding on small ledges is more easier, in my opinion, in here than it is in uh, X. So you will have a high chance of belling more if your board don't loop all the way. Um, session is very unresponsive. Most times the game crash lately more in a while than usually. One thing about this game that really, in my personal opinion, I haven't been playing like that. Because it's buggy. Like anything you do, mostly grinds, certain stair spots. It's so buggy, and you do outlandish stuff like that. Bell, um, that's one of the shoot. Only when you do pop, the heck you popping late. So it's like very unresponsive and glitchy. That shit like that is one thing. That's one. Um, y'all love session. Yeah, I love session. But there's so much stuff I want to see in the game. There's so much missed opportunity in session that I believe that session after more patches and you know full release that announced would be a great game. But I think also still having problems in certain aspects. You know, it's more realistic on session, like the speed. Um but it is more glitchy. Like the feels more realistic, the pops, the loops. Speed and like the 
bugs and glitches that really mess session up. Stuff like that. So I think at the moment, um, go ahead buy sessions and for you to buy both games. Many of those sessions are very early development and the bugs and glitches is more happen is more unresponsive lately. Sometimes you get a good session and um and be stuck in. even though the, the game glitch and all that at least it gives you the option to walk off the board if you glitch on the stair step or if you're trying to go to like a certain spot of the game that on um I believe that session have a whole lot of um patch like a good polish game because I feel like sessions like the speed wise is more realistic but it limit you know some of the controls <coughs> like if I want to uh, um pop a whole lot over there, I can't pop a whole lot, I can pop once, so I can't hold my keep on popping them. Oh, I pay XO for a session in the wild. <laughs> the session was when XO first came out. The same exact day, the last time I played session. Um, I feel like in skate parks, session, street sale ride does it. Kind of bad, but like, I don't know, like, the, the way session is built, certain spots is amazing, certain paths. One thing about the game, but I think you know after the patches, uh, sometimes you can't control your board at all. Press and go, don't sound it. But I would believe you know it will come out be a good game. Yeah, when it's um, but. X session do better than XO when it comes to free. Like, you know, get off the board and if you bail a certain spot, you'll find it. Then I believe uh, option to get on and off the board. With all the bugs and glitches, you know, it's in the previous state. I can see session getting the hardcore skater. For like, you know, real, like very, very realistic. But for like, a realistic and more control and fastest pace speed game, both press the speed X official real life skate one. This game is for you. Type like plus low I mean like a speed. So the question leads to which game is the best game in Xbox at the moment. Um I'll put XL is the best game at the moment at the see at the game. Given the XL yet glitches also, but the fluency of the game is more better because the glitches in here is more occasionally than it is in XL. But after the update and the game release, now I believe no. Session will, you know, come out and put a tough fight. And it's only twenty dollars. Ain't can complain. The other games get higher, and you know, the same issues happen, but worse. 
so between each session I would recommend all this stuff going on right now. But if session could run ball from the walk on the board and bail it like bail at the spot closer like repair the spot that you bail at closer and a mile away then the then the outcome would be cool. I would go for the NXL at the moment. Really? I really would. But if they use the options like session, they're really both not ready yet, in my personal opinion. So I would go like in different, in between both games. Look out for the updates. Okay. So. If you want to pay session or extra, whatever you prefer, it's your opinion. Um, I'm gonna see what the next update for session gonna be. I think it's gonna be next week. I think I'm not 100 sure, but I read something on Instagram saying there were updates coming up in the following week. So hopefully next week. It's an update for a session. So you might see an update or something. Or whatever. And if not, you know, at least they both companies reaching out and hearing you know, the whole community update right. Put some thing, you know, shoes, whatever you feel like the shoes. But remember both games got, you know, it's glitches and bugs. And Tell fluency and less you it's still buggy but less buggy than XL in the XL in the I mean that is a little session in the preview. So um you're gonna spend this both of them. And I wanna see in session both games improve. And I really do wanna see session um I want to see like more patches in session because it's unbearable sometimes you can't control your own person it's so unbearable um they only have those and also value of both games both are not ready in my opinion at all so I'll get like a stronger nod to exhale a little bit more polish, you know, you get a whole work on the improvement game. Um, predecessor, rival, session. I hope their next patch, uh, fix all the bugs in the game. I really do hope, I mean, maybe not all, but I hope, you know, it's more smooth. Than that goes to the That's what everybody's complaining about. Too much bug go flow in the game at the all day ammo. It's very unresponsive at times. So make sure you guys try this channel. Choose which game you want. Um buy both. Support both of them. If you have Xbox, um Thank you for watching my channel. This video from YouTube. It's not edited at all. No, um. Just showing things. Let's bring to the table at the moment. And if both of the games do what the fans want to see in each game, I mean, both games would be great. And hit the other part. Hit the slight edge XL. But also still hoping and following the official studios that session. So we're playing both games still. Support both of them. Have both of them. Just like, build it together. Well, Mr. Flash, I know.